Minecraft. He's on the gaming systems every day. Minecraft happens to be his favorite, but there's probably not a day that he's not either on the Xbox or on the iPad or on my iPhone. Um, the way you can craft stuff, like anything you want, you can craft anything you want. Minecraft is has a lot of positives to it in games like that. So that you're building, you're creating a world, you're solving problems. And so I think that that is an example of a game that could be very positive for children. They're so much more connected. They could do it in the car. They could do it anywhere, anytime. They could do it in their bedroom. They borrow the phones. There could be ways in which playing it too much could be a bad thing. And I think, again, parents have to think about the number of hours, what game it is, whether or not the child is playing by themselves or with friends or with a parent. I mean, there's a lot more to it than just a, putting a certain hour on it. I mean, the worry is that maybe he does not enjoy being outside as much or he does not enjoy socializing as much or he does not enjoy having the company of other people as much. Maybe if parents kind of talk to kids about, hey, this could help you in this way down the road or I like to see that you're figuring out how to solve problems or you're figuring out how to build things or you're figuring out how to ration your resources, that those are all good skills to have.